how are you? I am so excited to show you this today. I wasn't sure what to film on um, this week, especially since last week. I just did not have it in me to do a video. We've been really um, starting the summer with a busy bang and I wanted to just take a weekend to rest. So I hope that was okay with you guys because <laughs> I did it anyway. But um, today I'm going to show you this awesome tip I found uh, from this really neat gal that I've... Um, She's got another YouTube channel and she gives all these really great DIY hacks, cleaning tips for on a budget. So um, I will link that up here. <laughs> but this one was how to clean your shower grout. Um, because we just like, we have this problem in our shower and it's an older shower. We probably will remodel it eventually. But um, it just gets these nasty black lines on the tile and the grout and I hate looking at it when I would take a shower. So um, this is what this looks like. Let me show you right now. So I'm using this Clorox toilet bowl cleaner with bleach and it's like a gel and what she said to do, and then you can see it looks like a bloody murder scene with green, what she said to just go along the grout with this, um, with this cleaner and I got two of these at Walmart for like literally three dollars. So they're very, very cheap. Word to the wise though, you're gonna wanna do this in a well-ventilated area. And so once you put on the gel, and like she said, you probably should wear gloves and a mask, but I'm not gonna do that. <laughs> um, then you let the gel sit on the grout for like 30 minutes to an hour. And in some of the worst spots, you wanna put like paper towels or napkins um, to hold the cleaner to the really yucky spots. And like, I can already see it working I only put it on like five minutes ago. This is crazy. So I'm so excited to show you a before and after. Um, I guess I could have <laughs> taken a video of what my shower actually looked like before. It it wasn't that bad. It just had a lot of orange and a lot of mildew and like soap scum buildup. So um, I'm gonna go ahead and clean this and then I will show you what it looks like after. <laughs> realizing that this is what I do on a Saturday night for fun and how sad that is. No, no, but really, like, I was out all day today, so this is somewhat relaxing for me. Don't judge. Oh, and I'm using one of those hard bristle brushes you guys should probably get the dollar store. I've had this thing forever and I use it for scrubbing my tubs and showers and stuff, so. This is working better, I think, than a toothbrush because it's got hard bristles. Okay, so I finished scrubbing. That was a lot of work. <laughs> um, I don't even think I got it as clean as I could have just because it's like an awkward angle and it takes a lot of elbow grease to get in there. More importantly, I think we just need our shower regretted. But I do think this would be an excellent way to get just general soap scum off of your um, off of your shower. So let me show you the before and after. <laughs> Make sure you get all of the bleach residue off of your shower so you're not inhaling fumes for your next morning shower. <laughs> My husband's super sensitive with bleach actually, so I have to be really careful um, when I use bleach in the house. I actually, I don't love to use chemicals. I try to be as natural as I can. I clean with a lot of essential oils, but sometimes you just gotta use a good chemical and get out all the guck. So that's what we did today. Really happy I tried it. You should too. Check out that girl's channel um, from Do It On A Dime. She's awesome and I highly recommend a lot of what she's helped me learn. So yeah, hope you all had a great Father's Day weekend. Um, our plan had been to go camping with my husband and my kids and some friends of ours, but it just didn't work out with weather and there was some sickness going around, not in our family, but we just had to cancel our trip. So that was kind of sad, but we are happy that we got like a staycation here at home and um, got to do a farmer's market today and hiking yesterday and just like lots of fun things that we've been meaning to do as a family. So hope you got some good family time with your father figures. Have another amazing week. Um, I would love to hear what all what you're learning and what you're going through this week. Um, go ahead and comment below. 
like this video if you got a good tip from this and I will see you again next week. Have a great day. Don't forget to go get messy, have fun, and learn.